My mother loved my father, and she hated her neck. She thought it was too fleshy or something, so she wore turtlenecks all the time. She had them in every color of the rainbow. She had blacks, she had whites, she had grays, plaids, polka dots, hound's tooth checks and stripes, and even a sort of mesh turtleneck. I can't picture my mother without a turtleneck on. Although, according to Freud, I try to every moment of every day. I've got this photograph of me as a baby wearing one of her turtlenecks, swimming in it, really, just a bald head and this big shirt. It's a rare photograph because I'm smiling in it. I didn't really smile all that much during most of my childhood. I'm taking lessons now, trying to learn again, but it takes time. I stopped smiling when my mother stopped wearing turtlenecks. I came home from a typical day in the second grade to find her taking a bath in her own blood on the kitchen floor. Her turtleneck was on the kitchen table so that it didn't come between her knife and her neck. I understood then why she had always worn turtlenecks. To stop the blood from flowing. To cover the wound that had been there all along. They tried to cover it up at her funeral with one of her favorite turtleneck dresses, but it didn't matter. My mother wasn't hiding inside anymore. I look at that photograph of little me inside her shirt all the time. It's the closest I can get to security. I don't have a picture of me inside her womb, but her turtleneck is close enough.